as protesters gathered outside the Fowler Center to speak out against the Learns Act. Inside, Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders addressed concerns from the law that she signed on March 8. How do we help prepare kids to go either immediately into the workforce upon high school graduation or into a vocational or trade school, a community college, or a four-year degree? Huckabee Sanders says she wants to assess students earlier to help them figure out what path is right for them. For the Brooklyn School District, who was in attendance, two areas of concerns were addressed. The school is currently looking to add teachers to the school district and wants to know how to reward those veteran educators. A teacher who maybe has a master's degree and has been teaching for 20 years or more is now going to make the same salary, $2,000 more than someone coming right out of college. The school's other concern is growth. Brooklyn School District is one of the fastest growing school districts in the state. So how are you going to address both of those? Huckabee Sanders said there was a plan to address both issues. We've given more allocation for facilities funding and done that for the next couple of years so that there is potentially more money available because of that issue that so many schools are running into. Huckabee Sanders also said the state would help pay those teachers longer than the year. I am elated <laughs> to hear that that funding is going to continue year after year after year. I think that's important to a lot of the school districts. And while Johnson feels one issue was addressed, her question about veteran teachers was still unanswered. There's still some questions on what we can do and where we can get funding to be able to recognize these teachers who have been in the classroom for 15, 20, 25 years.